us discuss one of the property of T naught space. A subspace of a T naught space is a T naught space. Subspace of a T naught space, which is hereditary property of a T naught space. Let us prove this. We need to consider a subset. Let Y be a subspace or subset of a T naught space capital X. What we need to prove? To prove y is also t naught space. For this, let us consider two distinct points x and y. Since y be the subset of x, x and y belongs to y implies x and y belong to x also because y lies inside capital X. No, that's why. As you know, capital X is a T naught space. Therefore, there exists an open set, say capital G in capital X, such that X belongs to G, Y does not belongs, belong to G. Now, Y is a subspace of capital X and capital G is open in X itself. This implies Y intersection G is open in Y. G is an open set. So Y intersection G will be open in Y because Y belong to X. So uh, Y is having less or equal elements of capital X. So, we need to consider Y intersection G. Okay. Also, X belong to Y intersection G and Y does not belong to Y intersection G because here X belong to Y and X belong to G. Right. X belong to Y. X belongs to G. Therefore, X belong to Y intersection G. But Y does not belong to G. Again, Y belong to capital Y. But Y does not belong to G. Therefore, Y does not belong to Y intersection G. Thus, for any X and Y belong to capital Y with X not equal to Y. That is X and Y are distinct elements. There exist an open set say capital Y intersection capital G in Y such that X belong to Y intersection G and Y does not belong to Y intersection G. Therefore by definition Y is a T naught space. Hence, every subspace of a T naught space is T naught space. This proves the theorem. Remember one thing in the case of proving hereditary property or this subspace property of a topological space, you need to consider this Y intersection G as open set because. In, the, in this case, G is one of the open set in capital X. We need to consider open set in Y. So, 
in y we need to consider the open set g is the open set of x so we should restrict g such that it should belong to only y therefore we are considering y intersection g in all the theorem of this type uh, we follow the rule of this uh, common point or a common open set in y okay this proves the theorem